Hello my friends, I'm very happy to see you on my channel. Also, thank you very much for your likes and comments. If you haven't subscribed yet, you can always do it by clicking that button below. And today I want to talk about those little guys. Yeah, it's memory sticks for our Steam Deck. So the questions for today is how much memory you need to buy, what company you should prefer, where you can buy those cards, and how to put your memory stick in your Steam Deck and format it. So the first question is how much memory do you need to buy? So it depends from two things. The first thing is how much memory do you have internal in your Steam Deck? It can be 64 GB, it can be 256 GB or 512 GB. So it's just simple, if you have less space here, just buy bigger SD card. The second thing is about what games do you prefer to play on your Steam Deck. So uh, if you prefer to play just light games, uh, old games, emulators or something like that, so then I think you even don't need a big sized memory uh, SD card and you can use like uh, something not big. But uh, if you play in big AAA projects like um, Cyberpunk, uh, like Metro Exodus, so you can see that the modern game, it's like Metro Exodus, it's uh, almost 80 gigabytes of uh, space need to install that game on your Steam Deck. And if you want to install a few games like that, maybe five or six games, you must have a really big micro SD memory card for that. I think it's just normal. Okay, I understand that you can say just buy the best SD card with much space on it, but large sized cards cost money, so you can save a little bit because of my video and buy something like a case for your Steam Deck or something like a power bank, or etc. Actually, if you didn't know, you can use multiple micro SD cards for your Steam Deck. So you can install one game to one SD card and uh, another game to another micro SD card and just bring it with yourself somewhere in a special pocket. And then if you need to change the game to play another game, you just can change your micro SD cards and that will work too. So if you have many micro SD cards for 64 gigabytes or 128 gigabytes or even 32 gigabytes, you can easily use it like me. Okay, the next question is what manufacturer of the memory card should you prefer for your Steam Deck? There are many, many, many uh, kinds of companies that produce uh, memory cards because now there are many Chinese companies, there are many, many Korean and etc. companies, and there are different prices. So sometimes you can really uh, save some money when you're buying not Samsung or not uh, SanDisk memory sticks. But I highly recommend you do not buy unknown Chinese memory sticks. You know, when you see some commercial in internet, when company is selling uh, memory sticks uh, like uh, with name of something like not sun disk or sun pisk or uh, some letter is missing or it's just uh, without sun disk it's just it just looks like sun disk and uh, the sign is ultra is here gigabytes is here micro sd is here but without SanDisk naming, so it's not SanDisk, it's just a company that wants to uh, that wants you to see that memory card and wants you to see, think that it's SanDisk, but it's not. So if you see the memory card, you know, like with that sign SanDisk, with uh, a box that uh, isn't look like original, please don't buy it because you will see that uh, many cheaters in the internet they are selling like fake micro SD cards and the speed of that card can be really really lower than from original so try to buy only original companies like Samsung, like SanDisk, like Kingston, PNY and many many other companies that you can know and recognize the second thing about when you're looking for memory stick in internet, uh, such sites on Amazon, AliExpress or something like that, 
and you see that the price for one terabyte card of 512 gigabytes is cost like 64 gigabytes cards from you know like popular company it's not it can be a true you know like uh, it's uh, cheating because uh, some of manufacturers actually in china they do one interesting thing they just taken 64 gigabytes cards or even maybe 32 gigabytes or even 16 it doesn't matter they uh, write in on that one terabyte or two terabytes or how much terabytes do you want <laughs> to buy and they make in a special program firmware here so when you put in that card on your pc or or your mobile phone or somewhere else it think it thinks that it's really one terabyte of place there and um, it will show you one terabytes free space but when you will copy some files here it will do like video registrator cards it will uh, copy from one side and erase from another side so it's like a cycle and uh, all your files will be like in a cycle copying and erasing copying and erasing when the real size of that memory card will be done so it is just a fake sd cards they don't work properly just remember it if you see really cheap sd card in internet and the sign is like one terabyte 512 gigabytes and it's like chinese company manufacturer or something like you don't know what that company just save your money don't buy it yes it can be like two times cheaper even three times or five times cheaper i saw on amazon some cards for 20 dollars maybe 25 for one terabyte but it can't be a true it it's not a fairy tale so just don't buy that if you want to save your money buy authorized cards from samsung from sandisk i just highly recommend you a memory stick cards from sandisk it's the best option for all the devices sandisk it is very nice company with very very nice micro sd cards i'm using sandisk uh, for a long time with my gopro with my cell phones with my cameras and uh, just believe me it's the better memory cards that you can have so the next question is where to buy all these memory cards you have a two ways the first way is just to go offline to the shop and to buy it you can just ask manager to help you or you can ask to show you what do they have and you can be sure that your memory card will be original if it is a big shop and uh, you can just see uh, before you buying it what uh, you know like all the licenses it uh, you can see all the license stickers here and everything like that it is the simplest and safest way to buy a micro sd card for you but not all the shops have all the memory cards you must wait maybe sometimes while they will bring it to their storage and maybe they don't have the size and the prices is a little bit higher so the second variant it is to buy from online stores i recommend you amazon shop it's uh, the easiest way to buy uh, memory sticks in uh, america and europe but you can also buy it on aliexpress and ebay but be careful because uh, on ebay and on aliexpress it's uh, amount of fake cards it's much bigger so you must be sure that the seller is not cheating and uh, he is selling original sd cards and uh, micro sd cards and he is selling you know like um not fake and even on amazon you can be cheated by the sellers because amazon it's like a trading company but not all of their goods are you know like by their protection there are many 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 sellers that just sell their goods on amazon so if you buy a memory stick uh, from amazon be sure that it's under amazon protection 
that it sends from Amazon because Amazon is like collaborating with the big companies with Samsung, with SanDisk and etc etc etc. And if you are buying a cheap card, yeah, it can be okay. All that I say, it's not, not like a rule, you know, but it really can be a problem with it in future. So just spend a little bit more money to buy a quality thing, you know. I bought SanDisk microSD memory card because it was some sales on Amazon. So let's look how to format it in our Steam Deck and how it fits there and everything like that. So there is our microSD card, 512 gigabytes. Yeah, <laughs> I like it so much because now I will have a free space for my games. So uh, here is our Steam Deck and uh, here I have one microSD card here for uh, 256 gigabytes. I thought that uh, it will be a good card for me with uh, much space, but I was wrong. And now I will use uh, two that memory cards for games, this one and this one also. So let's put um, our memory stick inside of our Steam Deck and uh, how to do it correctly. You just holding it like this, the top of our uh, memory card when you can read, where you can read SanDisk Ultra and etc. Uh, to the top of the screen. So you push it a little bit like this and it's inside now. So now our memory stick is inside. We can easily see here because of that icon that appears here on the top. And if we push on that icon, it goes to the system options. And here we can choose format SD card option to make it work with Steam Deck. Because you need to format your uh, SD card first before uh, using it in Steam Deck. Because if you format it in your PC, it will not work properly. So you just need to do that on your device. So when the formatting is done, uh, we can go to our storage to check that now we have our micro SD card with uh, 468 gigabytes free space. So we can install new games uh, here on our SD card. Thank you for watching guys. Hope it was a useful video for you. Have a nice day and goodbye.